I play like one to two hours. Very often, all the time, just can't stop playing them. So what do you think is the main reason behind their gaming? I don't know, I think it could be Alpha, or it could be the Locust setting a trap. That's not exactly what I asked Marcus, but thanks anyways. The main reason behind all their gaming is because games have evolved from this to this. In only 20 years, in those mere two decades, games have become bigger more artistic deeper stories to follow as you play, unlike the old games, which we just played to kill time. Some games aren't just blowing things up. Some can be like Portal, where there is a lot of thought-provoking puzzles one has to complete using different tools. Portal uses a nifty device that launches dimensional portals wherever you please, allowing you to finish different tasks. Now, of course, we always have the shooter genre, but nowadays it's taken a little differently. With games like Call of Duty 4 and Gears of War, for example, they make us feel like we're watching a movie instead of playing a video game, taking us frontline in the world of warfare with great sound and visuals to help tell the story. Yes, you blow things up. However, its online component gives people a chance to speak with others across the world. Xbox Live, the online setting of the Xbox 360, currently has 7 million users. Everyone online is playing games like Call of Duty 4, Gears of War, and even games like Fantasy Star Universe. This gives everyone a chance to build their social skills and meet and learn about other cultures. So the next time someone says video games are bad and only rot your mind, they may want to reconsider and maybe pick up a controller. Because you know what? That's not true. I'm Will Sop, signing off. Thank you.